Hey guys, it's Ash, and today I'm going to do a 100,000 Dark Elixir farming run, and I'm going to record my progress. I'm expecting to get it done in under 10 hours. Now, of course, I'm not going to upload a 10 hour video. I don't think anyone would want to watch that unless maybe if you're extremely dedicated. Uh, so instead, what I'll do is edit all the gameplay and break it down into parts. And in each episode, I'll have about four to five live raids. I could give you like 50 raids to watch in one video, but not only is that too much, it also takes a very long time to edit that many raids. And uh, you guys know me, I like to focus on quality over quantity. So as soon as I have each episode edited and ready, I'll upload them frequently in about every 12 hours. So I'm expecting this to be a very fun new series, especially since every raid is going to be a live raid. And you guys should be able to learn a lot from this, as I know a lot of people have been having a hard time farming right now uh, due to the update changes. So hopefully this gives you guys a better understanding of how farming efficiently and effectively in the current metagame is. Uh, currently, as you can see, I have 38,000 Dark Elixir, and I'm hoping that by the end of the day, I'll have 138,000. Uh, and that's gonna be my goal. So let's start. Okay, first raid. We have a Town Hall 10 with multi infernos and basically max defenses. And I'm gonna attack it. I'm not afraid of this. <laughs> uh, the Dark Elixir isn't too hard to get, it's just right there. There's probably Teslas right there. Uh, probably has a loaded Klein Castle since it does look like an active base. But let's see. Um, I'm gonna spread out my Barbarians here to distract that Archer Tower. And. Wall breakers couldn't break open the first one, so let's try that again. Just need one wall breaker there. Okay, great. And uh, I'm going to spread out my barbarians. I'm going to remove that army camp as well. We have a problem there with that level 8 mortar, but that's fine. Uh, going to send out 1, 2, 3, raid spell. Send out my king, queen, rest of my barbarians and archers. Come on, make it through. King is going outside. Okay, typical king. But anyways, I've opened up that layer of wall, and now I just need to get that Dark Elixir. Gonna send out minions over the walls to target that Dark Elixir. Just gonna go for that Dark Elixir, come on. Queen targeting the Dark Elixir, perfect. And activate the king's ability, and we're gonna head out. So, quickly, 2400 Dark Elixir, great start. Okay, found this on my first next. We have 2400 Dark Elixir. Looking at the drills, they're empty. If you look at the top, uh, they're empty, so that means all the Dark Elixir are, are inside these uh, the storage and the Town Hall. Okay, let's attack this base, even though it's a max defense base, doesn't matter to me. I'm going to use... I'm going to create some space, so let's see. I'm going to remove that gold mine. Just remove that gold mine. Those are uh, level, level 11 Archer Towers, so... I'm not going to remove too many structures because it's going to require too much work against uh, the powerful defense there. And then I'm going to spread out my giants, spread out two uh, groups of wall breakers because of that wizard tower. Now I'm going to send out more of my giants. Okay, opened it up successfully. Place a jump spell there, a uh, raid spell, send out my queen. And let's help her out with those healers. I don't know why I have healers. <laughs> I think I cooked them overnight, uh, but it's all cool. I'm not gonna use my clan castle troops because I don't need them. As I, I'm, I'm pretty positive that I, w I don't need them. Uh, those healers went to heal my giants. Okay, that's fine. Anyways, my giants have made it to the core. They're de uh, distracting all the defenses. And now here, uh, I have archers targeting that Dark Elixir. I'm going to have my queen take out the Dark Elixir. And then I'm going to head out again. 1800 Dark Elixir. Nice. And obviously, I'm dropping cups because I do want to drop down to like uh, Gold League or Crystal, Low Crystal 3. We'll see. Okay, nice. About 2500 Dark Elixir. So there's like around 2000 Dark Elixir inside that storage as the drills are empty. Uh, let's check for the Clan Castle first since it's right there. Okay, there's nothing inside that clan castle. Yeah, it's empty. All right, perfect. Uh, let's remove this army camp. Those defenses are out of range, perfect. And is this out of range too? Yeah, the elixir collector and the army camp are out of range. Now, I'm also gonna remove, let's see, I'm gonna remove this barrack 
just because it's a bit too close just to be safe uh, barracks don't have too much hit points so I don't have to worry too much about that uh, there's a clan cast there's a skeleton trap right there okay uh, let's move those skeleton traps like up here so they don't they don't become a problem and then I'm gonna spread out my giants send out my barbarians and archers and then we're gonna send out two groups of uh, wall breakers use a heal spell right there break inside the first layer send in my queen and then send in my uh, clan castle troops and it should be very easy to get that dark elixir storage over the wall for my queen so here I don't need to use another uh, heal spell even though I could just don't need to cuz uh, it's enough to get that dark elixir as that's my main main target so here as you can see my giants are shielding my queen and she's gonna be able to very easily get it as those both of those expos are uh, being distracted by my giants perfect she's targeted the dark elixir storage awesome not gonna activate her ability just yet okay I'm gonna activate it right now and head out with that dark elixir nice 1936 okay great around 2500 dark elixir again and uh, it's right there guarded by two heroes but that's fine it's pretty easy to get just have to break inside this layer and then go for it let's fir uh, let's first test for that clan castle it's a level 8 clan so most likely it is loaded with uh, troops so spread out my barbarian sends out a wall breaker and yep there are archers right there and watch the trick that I do here I'm just gonna pull those archers out and then I'm gonna make them pull my barbarians in pull my barbarians in and that's gonna pull more archers out let's keep doing that keep pull my barbarians in and pull the rest of his clan castle troops out awesome and uh, here I'm just gonna clump them up a bit and use my poison spell uh, I don't want to waste too many of my barbarians and archers as if I if I was to use uh, barbarians and archers to kill all of them it's gonna require a lot of them and I won't have enough to uh, get that dark elixir so here what I'll do now is let's see yep that barrack is out of range remove that with a few archers and uh, use a barbarian there or two to quickly remove that don't have to worry about that gold mine it's uh, far apart far away from uh, the army camp right there so now I'll spread out my giants have the defenses distracted open up the first layer send down my archer queen as I have all of these troops uh, shielding her send in more of my uh, giants let's hit him hard send everything in and uh, let's also place a heal spell right here perfect so that should do it I should get my dark elixir pretty much instantly uh, and possibly the town hall as well with the archer queen's range okay great she's probably gonna go after the level 7 mortar right afterwards though yeah she's gonna go after the mortar and maybe she's gonna go after this way no she's going for the elixir storage and then uh, probably the air defense okay that's good enough so we're just gonna end it there I guess or let's see she's gonna go after that way and she's gonna go for the town hall I guess I'll take the town hall since she's already targeting it and obviously uh, the town hall occupies dark elixir so come on come on quickly there we go so we've stolen 25 2500 dark elixir nice okay here we have 2100 dark elixir nice uh, let's remove this army camp first with a few barbarians and archers clan castles right there so let's test again right here a few barbarians and wall breaker nothing inside okay great and uh, let's attack from this side we have six giants this time but that's fine more barbarians and archers so open up that first layer keep sending in my barbarians and archers uh, send in my queen king even though I don't need my king for this attack uh, let's just go for it and he has very weak defenses so let's use a heal spell right here there's nothing there's literally nothing he can do uh, I don't know why that wall breaker went for that well there's nothing there anyways I've opened up that inner layer perfect all my troops are going in and we could use a raid spell but you know I don't really need it uh, King's getting harmed so we're gonna activate his ability here uh, I'm thinking of going for that town hall don't really need my king for farming so that's fine I'll just go for the town hall I have lost like 70% of his health but that's fine don't really need the king for farming so have 2,000 dark elixir nice 
Okay, that will be it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If you did, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys again soon in the next episode. Later.